Off dad and I'm here at Fraley Park today I'm gonna to do a challenge uh, I'm naming it the naughty or nice challenge the idea behind this is um, if I birdie a hole I get a gift so I'll, uh, I've got a bag of numbers that correlate to a disc in my bag each one does so I'll draw a number and I get to add that disc if I bogey a hole I lose the last disc I got and if I par I just stay the way it was and I'll be throwing a glimmer PA3 off of the T for hole one I did that with a random number generator which I'll put a video of up right before uh, the first hole but yeah let's see how this goes it's gonna be random what discs I get so thanks for checking in and uh, if you like these videos please like and subscribe all right so my plan is i'm gonna do this real quick this is random number generator i'm gonna click it three times and then it looks like four will be the number of the disc i pull out the bag for my first shot starting the numbers so i go one two three and four it's a glimmer 400 PA 3 I do want to point out on this hole I don't know if you can tell where the basket is there's uh, the walking path goes in front of it when it's in this position we play it as an island so if I don't make it across the walking path or if I go over the fence it's OB and I go to a drop zone to putt for a 3 so you want to make the island did get a birdie on hold one. So I'm gonna draw a number out of here. It's the uh, one I've got which is four already. And I'll pick a different one. Number eleven, kind of faint. Let's see. Oh my other disc I can throw right now. Kel Visca M4. Eighteenth disc, street team stamped. F five. This hole we actually play a mando to the left of the telephone pole out there. So, it's a little chilly today. I usually throw a PA4 on that hole. And that one is a little bit more stable than I was thinking. I tried to not overthrow the hole because it's short and I just whipped it left. But yeah, there's still a chance at making a putt. But I've got a PA3 and an M4 still to use. So, let's see if I can make this putt.
So a little fact about these uh, courses here. Mainly what you'll be seeing me play a lot on this channel is nine holes, and that's because that's all we have right now. We're working on getting some 18 hole courses in. But uh, Fraley and uh, Camp Bethel, and there's one at Lenawisco in Wise County, and uh, that's all we got there on nine holes. So I usually am going to be doing nine hole videos until we get 18s in, but hopefully that'll be next year. I think Camp Bethel, I'm going to be able to get at least to 12 holes. It's weird, but I think I'm going to be able to get them a few baskets in. But yeah. Par. So that shot there was the Calavisca M4, which actually wasn't bad for that hole, but usually I'll just throw some motor stable forehand out and try to let it dive back to the basket in this position. Went too bad. I might have a putt, but I might have trees blocking it too. Whoa, gimbal chill. <clears throat> ready for the spring it ain't even been that crazy cold yet <sighs> let's see what it looks like I think that was as good as I could have done that. By the way, please subscribe, like, like, like these videos if you do, like them, whatever, share them with your friends. See if we can get this channel up some. I'm gonna do a giveaway at 250 subscribers, so yeah. Just why? To understand people. Happy. Awesome. Wow. So this hole is out behind the porta potty out there. And this has also been lately being played as an island across the path. You have to get across the path. And I don't have an M4 or anything now because that's just stupid bogeyed that last hole. So now I've got a PA3. I gotta try to see if I wanna get aggressive. I mean, I guess I do. Alright, so here's the predicament. I missed the island on that one. Parked it with a re tee. Technically, that's a four, and that's a bogey. So I'm gonna play this last hole, it's hole nine, two ways. And if anybody watches this, you tell me how I should score it. I'm gonna play, it. since that was my last disc, technically. And I said, if I bogey, I lose my disc. I'm gonna play it with a mini. And then I'm gonna also play it with the PA3 and score it and see how it goes. But yeah, I wasn't really planning on bogeying enough to lose every disc, so. Good day, summer comeback.
So the audio at the park was off for the uh, ending of the video, so I just wanted to do it real quick. Uh, with the PA3, I ended even with the Mini was plus one. Uh, so whichever way you think should be scored is what I'll do, but I've got some more reviews and stuff coming up, so stay tuned and just like and subscribe if you like these videos. Make sure you hit the bell so you get my notifications when something new comes up, but thanks for watching.